Greg's all frog here. Let's play Factorio. Doing a quick little once over for our plastic train. Um, okay. <laughs> My phone must have just completed a charge or something. We shouldn't do it there. Wait, we'll do it uh, just off the side of this, I think. What if I want to expand that? We could double it up off the top. Yeah, all right. Ah, uh, really? Okay, worked out okay. All right, the plastic train is what? One, two, one? So one, two, one, we just gotta fit four. Um, one, two, three, almost. You know, you know what, we're gonna come way up here actually so we can unload the two cargo wagons in a convenient spot. Uh, one, two, yeah, that's pretty good. All right, so this is going to be, I don't even know, circuit plastic, something like that? Yeah, circuit plastic. Circuit, circuit, plastic, return. Okay. That looks acceptable. Alright, and I need a three to one. Which is just a three to two. Alright, we'll do that. I suppose I could wait and split it in afterwards. And yeah, we'll do it this way. No, because you know what? I do want to prioritize that. So here... You should do this. And input priority to the left. All right, can I make a train? Nope, no engines. I really don't want to sacrifice the PAX train for this, but I might. Wouldn't it be nice to have a chainsaw again? Can I make one? I've got coal. I don't have coal. I can get coal.
Now we're cooking with chainsaws. Which probably is a OSHA violation of some sort, so I, I wouldn't recommend it. Is this a rocket launcher? Nice. So much nicer. Why not just do this? And we don't need this part. Now, we just need the train parts. Where is my train right now? There. Actually, that could be a problem. It will have a full inventory almost immediately. Is it above me? It's below me. All right, so we'll get home, get some train components. It does get fueled up there, it has to, right? Try and pay attention. Am I fueling that train? Yes, okay, good. Yeah, so I could just set it down there and let it go. Let it go, let it go. I guess I'll write it down. It's never going to get a light. <clears throat> oh, I'm chasing something. What am I chasing? I'm still not happy with fluid unloading wagon stations. All right, you might as well go back to oil because we're going to meet you there anyway. Do my biddings, robots. I figure out where the engines are over here somewhere, I think. I may even be making. I am. Haha. <laughs> am I making wagons anywhere? Yeah, probably not. It's fine. I can make wagons. Those, that's easy. Still my helicopter, too. I could play around with that. I have so much oil line. Eh, hey, whatever. Take a roundabout way since I know this spur is free. We'll build our train here. Get a little fuel that way. It's nice. Get a little fuel as well. You need to be white. It's just as white as the train gets. You're going to go to, uh, wow, RCU Plastic, I think? That's the return. I don't know what that's called. What is the name of this thing? Plastic Outpost 1. Okay, you're going to go to Plastic Outpost 1. Until you're full. And then you're going to go to... Um, uh, 
not RCU plastic, you're gonna go to circuit plastic return till you're empty. But before you do, we're gonna do half trains. Of course I can't. Go! Let's see where it goes. It's gonna have to go around, obviously, because of where I built this. Thought it might have went down through the station. But given the opportunity, I think the pathing agent usually takes you around stations, if I'm correct. It's been a while since I've really bothered to look into that, but I'm pretty sure that's that's the, the case. Here we go. We're going to be part of the stick. trains getting stuck this time. We have launched three rockets. Started at 99. So I mean, I think we're pretty safely at about seven, uh, every a rocket every seven minutes at the moment. Obviously we want to get faster than that, but. We would like to increase our gold science production as well. We don't have enough resources for that. Uh, shoot, All right, we need to hop out. We're gonna need some chain signals here now. Whoa, why didn't you go through there? Whoa, what are we doing? What the hell is going on? This is crazy. I can't wait to see what's going on with this. Obviously, we're going around, which is annoying because I didn't put any uh, bypasses in. Because it shouldn't have to do this. Ah. Uh, vestigial signals. Well, that's the one going in the proper direction, so... You got me stumped. It says we should be able to go across both. We should be able to go across both there. Which means it must be over here somewhere that messes it up. It's just because I don't have the double on this side as well. Or because those are off. Might be just because they weren't on the same... Um, same path. That could honestly be it. That should be part of a chain. That should be part of a chain. Make sure that's free. All right, that should do it.
I love how that just like ends. How like real life. Yeah, that plastic is greedy. Man, it should be pretty quick. I'm hoping I don't have to put the uh, bypasses in that it actually will work now. I do 4,000? Yeah, 4,000 is the point. I think it's a pretty good amount, honestly, for such a short track. There we go. Yeah, this is going to be great. This is going to be the way. I'm going to ride it one more cycle just to see if this is out or not. If it is, then we should increase the amount of stuff we put on it. Obviously, if we have to wait for the other train, it's going to be a different story, but... Which means, yeah, these inputs need to shoot. These two need to be, um, as well, uh, chain signals. How much that waits for? Wow, it's even empty. All right, yeah, cool. That's that's a good amount then. Yeah, that's good. So that should be plenty of plastic over there. Once it hits the other side, we're gonna turn it to ma to a manual. Okay, it's not there, so it doesn't matter. Out we go. And we change these bad boys to chain signals to make sure that it's empty when it goes through. Cool. We'll go say hello to our train. Two minutes left. We launched another three rockets. Ooh, that's good. Six rockets an episode. We're up to four minutes for a rocket. That's very, very good. What's the next thing we need to fix? In fact, there's no radar there. That's kind of annoying. I have power going to where a radar should be, probably. But no actual radar. Why is that? I don't know. We've got plenty of plastic coming in. Hmm. We're still nowhere near capacity. I guess the copper processing is next. Because these guys are being used wasteless. So we've got we've got to add we got to add more. Like, we should cut this off halfway and go, Phew! and then come down with a second one and just have eight. Because the number is obviously not 36. Although, if you look, there's only, like, four that aren't running on each side. Maybe we just need more processing. I mean, it's backed up. Might just need more. Wow. Oh, they don't all have speed modules. So that's some of it. All right, so let's go back to base. Grab ourselves some speed modules. And then throw them in. Oh, you know what? We're going to be out of time. Hold on. Just stop. We 
go back. Because we're out of time. Next time, we're going to go pick up some uh, modules, speed modules, and throw them into the processing. But for now, we're going to have to say adieu. Uh, good day, I think, overall. Accomplished. We've got another plastic run that will help the advanced circuits process even faster, which means that hopefully we'll get more yellow science pack, which would be ideal. We have moved up to six rockets in episode now, which is about one every four minutes. We're on, we're on every three and a half minutes, really, which is very good. So we're just going to three, more, three times more, and we'll be, <laughs> be good to go. But for now... That will have to be all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Stay updated to everything that happens. And until next time, cheers.